So we're outside the Russian Embassy in West London for a protest for Pussy Riot. Uh, and it's raining, it's drizzling, but that's okay because at least we're not in prison in Russia on a conviction of hooliganism, which is the fate that has fallen these three members of Pussy Riot. <laughs> Why does free expression for these three women matter? They're emblematic of a wider problem of free expression in Russia. If three artists can't say what they want to say, what about the investigative journalists and the business journalists and the financial correspondents who are reporting on Russian business and the activities of the Russian state? International business has invested in Russia. Russia has one of the biggest militaries in the world. This country needs to be properly scrutinised. We need to secure the freedom of expression for these three women, and by doing so, we can secure freedom of expression for everyone in Russia. This isn't just a problem for Russian avant-garde artists, it's a problem for everyone in the world. So by imprisoning these three women, the protest art, the feminist art that they propagate has been temporarily silenced. So what we're going to do today is put a bit of that art back into the world through a poetry protest. Larry, you look like a wound. Uterine and fold, cords not cut, carrying thumb. Jagged song against the patriarch, the fixer, the smooth word, and the truth. And the truth. They are wasted. They are a dead girl shitting on you. They are bad luck. Two, we speak because we want to be spoken to. Do you have something to say? Make four though. Lee Trickster dances Peter across pulsing boards. Three. Our whispers can scar the air. The three. Putting you down does nothing less than roar the riot wider. This is the country and the Russian. Свободной природы. Церковь внутри. Вас звучит собственной верой. Ортодоксальность. We favour the loud and loud. Свобода пусть и рай! Свобода пусть и рай!